we find we get so many benefits from sponsoring these students. It, it really is a no-brainer for us. From an internal perspective, it demonstrates to our own teams that we are constantly looking to improve and constantly looking for new ideas. And of course, and the benefits from the students are, are, are many in terms of they bring new thinking, new ideas. They're freshly trained in the theories. Uh, and that just helps awaken some of the ideas we have as an organisation and, and just provides new creative thinking that perhaps we're a little too busy with the day job to do for ourselves. I think developing and mentoring the students is, is actually key to getting the best out of the exercise, both for students and indeed for ourselves at Network Rail. So we put a lot of effort at working in partnership with Cranfield to prepare the scope of the study, to work through what it is that the students trying to get out of it, but equally what we're trying to get out of it. And then when it comes to the, actually de the delivery of that, that uh, assignment, we put a one-to-one -one, uh, coach with the students so they're not left on their own around a huge 44,000 person organisation that, that looks after the whole rail network for the UK. They have a mentor working with them and they're with them all the time throughout the study. And then when it comes to delivering the output of the work, we have two presentations, an interim and a final. And we make sure to give the work the respect it deserves we wheel out our senior team to hear those presentations and to quiz the students and, and challenge them on what they found so that we get the best value for the student and indeed the best value for us. So as with any exercise such as this, the quality of the preparation will determine the quality of the output. So we work closely with our friends at Cranfield to look at opportunities and problems in our organisation which are applicable to the learning for the students, but equally are very real problems for us. We're a huge organisation. We have four million customers relying on our services every single day, four million passengers. Not many organisations are of that scale. So on the one hand that can be quite frightening for a student coming in, but on the other hand that gives so many opportunities for these real world problems that we need to fix. Some of the problems may already be in, in, in uh, development, uh, we may have teams working on those already and the students may help and supplement those teams. Others will be a standalone piece of work that the student starts with a, the very seed of an idea and sees all the way through to the end. The key insight I would share with organisations who are thinking about sponsoring students is just do it. You know, it, it. I can't believe we're not fighting for these students every year. The quality of student is, is usually very high and we as an organisation get so much out of it. Not only do we get result and output that we can more often than not translate into how we run our organisation, but equally it has a, a, a knock-on effect to our own teams as well. They start engaging with newly qualified, newly educated students with the latest theory and they start to get interested in, in, in new things that they can learn as well. Maybe they've been in a, in a role for, for many years and that role might have been unchanged and it gets a little bit habitual. But the students bring with them that injection of new thinking, that energy, uh, which we could all do with a little more energy now and again. So we find it very useful both from the student's perspective but probably more so from our perspective.